In this video, I'll show you how to set up your 3D printer and make your first print. First, plug in the USB cable from your printer to your computer. Turn on your printer using the black switch in the back of the printer. If you don't have filament installed, or you'd like to make dual extrusion prints, go to the link in the description for installation videos on how to do so. Open Repetier and connect your printer. Once you have done so, go to the Print Panel tab and then to the G-Code field. Type in capital T, zero, and press enter. This will activate the right extruder. Scroll down and set your extruder temp to 230 degrees. You should also heat your bed to 80 degrees. Since the bed takes a relatively long time to heat up, this should be one of the first things you do. You should make sure that you're familiar with these manual controls at the top of the tab. The X moves the extruder head to the left and to the right. The Y moves the head forward and backwards, and the Z moves the print bed up and down. Go to the Object Placement tab. To add an STL file, you can simply press this button here. Find your STL file and press Open. We're going to use a pulley. To download this STL file, go to the link in the description. You can download it. Once you've added the STL file, you can move it around the print bed area by clicking on this button here. You can change the view of the print bed area by clicking on this arrow. Now head on over to Slicer. Slicer takes the STL file that you added to object placement, scans it, and converts it into G-code. Simply click Slice with Slicer, and it will do this process automatically. It shouldn't take that long, since the file is rather small. Once your extruder and your bed are up to temp, you can then click Run to begin the print.